Hello viewers and potential subscribers, you are watching Unknown Emerald and in this video, something a little bit different, I'm going to be showing you a tutorial on how to create custom response commands on Nightbot. So let's get to it. For the purpose of this tutorial, I'll be using my Twitch channel as the prime example to show you how it works. So I already put in a few commands using exclamation mark Nightbot. If I type in one more exclamation mark Nightbot, press enter, it will come up with a random response. So all of these over here are random responses and here is how you do that. You will of course need a Nightbot TV account. Here is mine and here is the list of all the commands I can use with my Twitch channel. So the one we'll focus on is it one over here, exclamation mark Nightbot. Let's go into edit, command exclamation mark Nightbot. This is just what you want the person to have to type out in order for the command to be activated. The message, don't worry about the scary code there. It looks very scary, I know, but all you will need to do is copy and paste this into your own message later down the line. The code for this will be in the description below, so all you will need to do is copy and paste that into your own message. User level everyone, this shows who um, can use this command. For example, if you want to be the only person to be able to use it, you will need to specify that and say the owner. But in my case, I want everyone to be able to use the message, so I have user level everyone. The cooldown, you can increase it up to 300 seconds and you can make it as low as five seconds and that's pretty much it for the command the only thing you will need to change in the command is this little section right here and we'll get to that right now the website you'll be using to maintain all your responses is pastebin.com now you don't have to make an account but i highly recommend you do as it helps you keep things organized over here i have a list of all the responses i have prepared for nightbot to use to create your own list you will just click plus paste at the top and you will paste the series of responses you want with your Twitch channel. Now, at the end of each line, you want to make sure you add a semicolon. This tells Nightbot at which point the sentence is finished and at which point the new sentence will start. So if I go back into my Twitch, I type in exclamation mark Nightbot, it will say, oh, enough about me. What have you been up to lately? So over here, let's see. Number three. So it takes the number three from this list right there. And once you have your list prepared, all you need to do is create the new paste. This gives you a new code. So with this code, all you need to do once again is copy it, go back into your commands and paste it into this section right here. And that's all we need to do. Once that's done, click submit. I'm not going to do that because I have already made that command. <laughs> Now, one more thing regarding the message is if you don't want Nightbot to respond to the person that initiated the command, all you need to do is get rid of this front section right here. And if you do that, it will just um, say the message without anyone's name. So, for example, once again, if I go back into my Twitch, I will use a different command that doesn't use um, the user section at the front. I'll type an exclamation mark gem, and it just says a random fact about a gem because, you know, I'm an emerald and it makes sense for my channel to have that, right? <laughs> Now, if you happen to be getting error codes when you type out the command at twitch.tv, the reason for that might be because you've added a symbol into the response section on pastebin.com. The only symbol you want to be using is the semicolon at the end of each sentence. If you add something like a quotation mark, it will mess up the code and it will make the command invalid. So just keep that in mind whenever you type out your responses at pastebin.com. Now, if this video came in useful, make sure to give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and consider following me on Twitch at twitch.tv forward dash unknown emerald. I stream games such as Halo, and I'm currently anticipating the release of Halo Infinite on that very channel. And with that being said, thank you once again, and I will see you guys next time, so see you.